Alright, uh, so uh, we made a video game enhancement uh, D2 FPGA project. Um, the purpose of it was to uh, enhance uh, split screen uh, video games. So generally when you play a split screen game, both the top and bottom screen uh, are on the same TV. So you can like screen peek at the other player's screen and know what they're doing. Uh, so we got rid of that by separating the screens into two separate VGA monitors. Uh, and we also added in different video effects that you can uh, use against your opponent to cause them to uh, have a harder time s seeing their screen. Okay, point out a few of the components. Uh, so, so there's there's the two VGA monitors, and the, there's two uh, there's two DE2 boards down yeah. in here. Don't, it, don't don't touch. Yeah, there's one on top and one on. Okay. On bottom. <laughs> but with that fine, fine custom connector there, <laughs> and then and, and so, and you have two DE2 boards because you needed two VGA connections, right? Yeah. So right. the the second DE2 board doesn't do anything. Uh, we're basically just using it for its uh, VGA DAC uh, chip. Mm -hmm. uh, so it just basically connects the GPIO ports straight into that. Uh, I see. And that's, so that's all it's used for. It's just a VGA pass through. Yeah. Okay, so let's see you play. Okay. Um, yeah. So right now it's showing both screens full screen. We just did that to make setup easier. But really, this is the way that our game enhancer works. Okay. So it, like Scott said before, it blacks out the the other players part of the split screen. And here you see like a ran, like a roulette going between eight different visual effects mm -hmm. and so we've added on top of the standard video game we've added these two buttons one for each player and by pressing it you can select a power at that time uh -huh. and if say I decide to use it right now Scott's screen will get visually distorted in this case it's a color inversion so here you see the image negative mm -hmm. but my screen is still the same and this is done to distract the other players. Some that's probably the least distracting of all the effects. So the <laughs> so these are all uh, effects on the video after it's been generated by the game. Yes. So so these are all your added effects without having to change the game dynamics at all. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. It, it okay. just serves as a like a, a layer between the the video signal coming from the Xbox. Right. From oh, altering there's a, there's it and an then Xbox sending it. over there. Oh, and, and the Xbox got fed in through the the VG uh, through the uh, video cable there, and then gets split into the two uh, VGA channels. Right, so now, okay, so play. Let's see what happens. All right, so uh, well, I'll play with well, <laughs> sorry, one hand. Yeah, you're you're a little bit, a little bit. So yeah, and then we can both be using an effect. So he has edges enhancement, and I have a I use Sobel on uh -huh. him. So, so it just you. makes it a little bit harder to see. Uh, so you're, and these last for some amount of time and then yeah. come back to normal. Yeah, so the, the, the effect lasts, lasts for 10 seconds and then there's 10 seconds uh, where you can't do anything. I see, and then um, it comes back on And then again. it eventually comes back. I see. <laughs> I'm in the lead. <laughs> um, oh, here so we have a, a few more. I think oh. this is a, the tunnel vision yeah. effect, so on okay. his screen. So when you press that, what happens? Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sometimes our D bells. Sometimes it play. glitches. Here, just, just here. <laughs> okay. Oh, blur now it's time. blur. <laughs> okay, so, so now now you've lost resolution. So you have to it's like yeah. squinting through your eyelashes. Yeah, blurs. Not the, uh, we had to reduce the amount of blur just because like to get a better blur you have to store a lot more. Mm -hmm. Lines uh, mm -hmm. and re ran out of M4K blocks. Hey Scott, hold. But, uh, stay looking it, it at me. It does enough of a blur. Yeah. So we also have this. Oh, oh you gotta look at me. Yeah. So I'm. <laughs> uh, so this 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 effect is specific for Halo. Mm -hmm. uh, specifically, like red versus blue teams. So this okay. flips the red and blue channels. So if you're oh. playing on a larger team, oh. all your allies will appear to be your enemies. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's so, horrible. Oh, sorry. Let me go on your screen. So, yeah. I, I see. just turned red on his screen. So now you have to... Uh, I see. I'm actually blue. 
And this. And here, hit hit B so you can see. And then he's blue. Right. His his arm there, but it's actually red. Yeah. Okay. So it just changes the color of the teams. Um, in in like a real team game. Uh, That'd be horrible. Yeah. 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 Okay, so what's the, what's the little little yellow thing do? Oh, so uh, that's a strobe. That's a strobe. Effect. Little orf. So uh, gets a little confusing yeah. to look around. That's horrible. Uh, Yikes! And what's that guy? Uh, oh, so this this isn't uh, this isn't an effect you use against someone. This is actually it's more of a power you. up. Yeah. Uh -huh. So this restores the split screen nature. Where so you can now I can see what he can see. I yeah. see. So you get I a can, peek into his world for a. I can know he's coming up behind me right there. Yeah, so now he knows where I am uh, for ten seconds. Yeah. Oh, that's very cool. Uh, I think we've actually gone through all eight. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Thanks, guys.